What's up guys? Uh, here at Gracie Bot, Texas, gonna demonstrate a, a combination attack from the omoplata, the shoulder lock, to a, uh, a side choke or head and arm choke. Okay, I'm gonna use uh, Isai Cabrera here. Uh, no gi and gi, Texas, 2011 Texas State Champ. Okay, he's always working hard. So I'm gonna go ahead and start off with the omoplata. I'm gonna I'm gonna assume, maybe incorrectly, that you already know how to get there. So this is maybe, maybe more of a, an advanced technique. So you have to know the shoulder lock first before we start working on this, okay? So I'm gonna start in the shoulder lock here, okay? And I get a good position, but a flexible guy, he can kind of face the wall and start to do his shoulder roll. Go ahead and just do it, you say. And he'll roll out, okay? And I can lose the position. I may still be on top, but I'll lose the submission, okay? So today, the focus of this technique is not to lose a submission. So we're going to change from one to the other. So once I have the guy in a compromised position, I'm going to go ahead and finish it off. So as I go here, he starts to roll. So look, he gives me this here. Okay? So I'm going to go like this. I can catch his collar if I need to. Okay? And then I'm going to start to walk. have to be careful. We may submit him as we start walking around because his arm may get caught. But let's say he gets it out. He's kind of smart. So I'm going to come here right into my head and arm choke, just like this, okay? So I'm gonna control here first, okay? And because he's on his side the way he is, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and catch my sleeve, okay? So the hand that's around the head is gonna put, it, my hand as deep as I can go in the sleeve. Don't just grab the, with your fingers, or you're gonna end up like crushing your fingers and you're gonna have to tape your fingers like this, okay? <laughs> So put your hand as deep as you can go, all right, and hold. And then you want to bring this hand over. So we're basically going to do a, an Ezekiel choke off the head and arm position, okay? So once I get here, now look, just change your base, and you're going to start to straighten your arms until I get the submission, okay? So again, we're gonna start in this shoulder lock, okay? And the idea is, one, the guy has a flexible shoulder and he's gonna start defending. So as soon as I feel him defending, this hand is gonna go here and I wanna catch his collar or just try, try to solidify my hand, okay? And then as he starts to put this shoulder down and starts to roll, I'm just gonna turn the corner. Again, you need to be careful because you may submit the guy here, okay? Most guys are gonna try to get their arm out. That's what I want. Because then I turn the corner, and I'm going to catch him right here. All right? Once I go here, again, because he's is on his side, my arm goes in, I get a deep grip, I come over, and I'll try to finish here. If it's not working, look, just throw your leg over. It doesn't matter if he catches your leg. It's fine. Sit, and then finish. Okay, so there you have a, a strong combination from one attack, the omoplata, to the next, the uh, side choke kind of Ezekiel variation. A strong technique that's incredibly hard to defend once we get it locked in. Okay, thanks guys.